Six. Now we want to get to your local weather experts, uh, get them involved right now because this problem is directly tied to the drought. Now, like much of Louisiana, there is a wide area upriver that is simply parched right now. And at this point, really, there's no end in sight. Chief Meteorologist Chris Franklin joining, joining us now uh, with a closer look. Uh, what area are we talking about here? Well, and as Meg accurately stated, it's not really the upper Mississippi River that feeds the lower Mississippi River, which is in a more considerable drought. It's actually the Ohio River. River. And so we look toward the Ohio Valley, which actually isn't as bad of a drought as it is up the Mississippi. More of the water that flows past New Orleans comes from the Ohio Valley. So we look to this area for the spring floods in terms of snowfall. But at this time of year, we're looking at rainfall. And unfortunately, this is the seven day rainfall forecast. Most of the Ohio Valley over seven days is only expected to get maybe a little bit more than a trace of rainfall. So their dry spell will continue. Now we will see maybe a little bit more rain up the upper Mississippi River, but that doesn't flow. It flows past New Orleans, but doesn't feed as much of the volume of water that actually comes past New Orleans. Now the uh, point of the river at the moment is at 2.4 feet and is holding steady and looking at the uh, extended forecast for the river, it's generally going to stay right near three feet. It'll kind of ebb and flow a little bit. Now, the lowest point the river has ever been in recorded history was 1.6 feet below kind of the standard gauge, and that was set in 1872. We've been talking about the river levels of 1988. That level was at its lowest point, only 10th of a foot. So it is not quite to the levels of 1988, but it is certainly some of the lowest that we have seen in quite a while. Not much rain in our forecast, but some good news for this weekend. It will turn less humid. We'll talk more about that in a few minutes. All right, Chris, thank you.